My beloved child, rest assured that I, your faithful provider, shall ensure that you lack nothing. This is not just a mere promise, but a commitment tuned to the intricacies of your situation and needs. In times of distress and uncertainty, close your eyes and let the echoes of my words fill your mind and heart with a profound sense of peace and tranquility. Surrounding you are numerous doors waiting to swing open, beckoning you to approach them with unwavering determination and conviction. I command you to take those steps without fear, for upon your lips I shall place the words you need to utter. Make the decision today to progress along your path, casting aside the immobilizing grip of fear. As you rise and walk, the windows of heaven shall open wide, showering you with abundant and genuine blessings, surpassing even your highest expectations. Your journey involves sowing and reaping, sharing, giving, and blessing. This cycle shall be perpetual every day, every month, and every year. Revisit and immerse yourself in these words until my command is crystal clear. Nourish your spirit with my written word and advance with unwavering determination. The time has come for you to awaken, allowing your faith to ignite, kindle, and accelerate the intricate plan I have meticulously designed for you over an extended period. Leave behind the shackles of defeat and the weight of guilt. Choose persistence, daily resilience, and pay no heed to the unfounded rumors and attacks from others. Forgive, continue forward, forget the hindrances, and move ahead. My word shall serve as your guiding light, your faith akin to a powerful sword, carving a path through any obstacles you encounter. Choose perseverance, for I shall grant you the strength to engage in the fight. Let it be known, I am your shepherd, your ever watchful provider. I comprehend your needs and am committed to supplying all that you lack and more. Declare with your lips and wholeheartedly affirm that you will persist, live, and believe without fear, undeterred by distressing news that may attempt to sow alarm in your heart. I comprehend the reasons behind my actions. My authority is absolute, and through my divine power, I can soothe tumultuous winds, part formidable seas, guide you across turbulent waves, lift you from the throes of agony, mend your physical body, and provide solace to your wounded soul. I am there to collect your tears when the world inflicts pain and affliction upon you. In times of distress, you find solace in your unwavering faith. Your love for me and your belief in my existence allows my presence to embrace and manifest within you, flooding your entire essence with boundless love and tranquility. Indeed, the passing of time does not inherently heal wounds, but I possess the ability to mend them without leaving lasting scars. The trials and tribulations of life will not leave lasting marks upon your spirit. Instead, they contribute to your growth in wisdom. I am here to alleviate you from the burden of painful memories. This is the reason my hands were willingly affixed to a cross, enduring cold and cruel nails, to bear your suffering purify your guilt through my shed blood. Bestow upon you my grace and alleviate your heart of all its burdens and sorrows. In moments of prosperity and adversity, in both health and sickness, rest assured that my presence will steadfastly remain by your side. I make you a promise. Miraculous occurrences will unfold in your life. Through these miracles, I illustrate the extraordinary possibilities that arise when my word is embraced and followed with a humble heart, acknowledging both trials and blessings with equanimity. There exist formidable circumstances that I shall alter for your benefit, battles and challenges that will guide you towards a more promising future, conflicts that will fortify your inner strength. If I allow these experiences, it is for your ultimate well-being. When I declare that I will be with you, shielding you from malevolence, it is an absolute commitment. You will thrive under my will, and I affirm that every good thing entering your life will be multiplied and blessed. This is my decree, and you must believe it without hesitation. Disregard doubts and do not let past failures or imperfections serve as excuses. Complete blessings await those who seek them. Pay no heed to accusations, criticism, or the jealousy of those attempting to undermine your bright future. 
Instead of succumbing to the grip of fear and anxiety, feel the gentle touch of my hand upon your heart. Allow the floodgates of joy, peace, hope, faith, and confidence to open within you. I am here to infuse your life with joy and to place words of praise upon your lips. A transformative shift awaits you and your blessings descend from the heavenly realms. Abundance will grace the halls of your home and the chains of debt and past errors that have plagued your finances will be shattered. In moments when scarcity seems to loom, I implore you to listen intently, believe in my words, and peer through the lens of faith. Be attuned to the open doors and opportunities that surround you. Treat those who cross your path with kindness, for I shall orchestrate the arrival of special individuals into your life, extending their hands to you just as I extend mine. Embrace a demeanor of friendliness and kindness, treating all with respect. For in doing so, I will bless you and utilize you in extraordinary ways that surpass your wildest imagination. The remarkable feats I intend to accomplish through you, especially in the midst of hardship, will elevate you to new heights. You will rise and shine brightly even in the depths of darkness, becoming a living testament to my presence in your life. Allow me to share a secret with you a message that I impart to many of my sons and daughters. However, not all choose to believe or accept what I offer, often providing numerous excuses. Some prefer the narratives that seek to ensnare them in misery, sin, pain, and sorrow, dismissing my blessings, words, and promises. Yet, I implore you to love me and believe in me. It is of utmost importance. Otherwise, you may squander precious time hesitating and rejecting the blessings I extend to you, with open hands. I know you are different. I have tested you on numerous occasions. I recognize the unwavering belief you hold in me, and my love for you knows no bounds. Accept my blessing now. You are cradled in my hands, nestled in my arms. Under the shelter of my wings, I carry you, protecting you from the fearsome adversaries who rise against you. Though your challenges may seem insurmountable, Rest assured that those who contend with you also contend with me. Your problems, though numerous, will not prevail. I shall deliver you, and those who harbor ill intentions shall be put to shame and confusion. Even as they surround you in their attempts to defeat you, I shall intervene and provide assistance. In just a few short days, you will turn your face, and your enemies will be no more. Many may be incensed by their inability to overcome you, unaware that your greatest ally is your staunch defender, your God, your Savior. Embrace unwavering faith, my cherished one, for in me there exist no boundaries of impossibility. Let the roots of belief run deep within you, and let your actions be an embodiment of that faith. Know that I am by your side, urging you to step forward with confidence having elevated your faith to new heights. I have endowed you with the ability to walk upon turbulent waters and to combat and overcome any malignant force that dares to challenge you. You are no longer engaged in solitary battles, for courage has replaced fear and the shadows of anxieties are left behind. With your sword held high, continue to navigate the battlefield, for the blessings that await you are vast and you shall triumph over the land set before you. In all situations, be it trials or triumphs, I shall provide answers and illuminate the path forward. My spirit anoints you, transforming you into a vessel of healing and encouragement for many hearts. The radiance of my blessings shall extend to your family, bringing forth an aura of peace and harmony that shall permeate your home. An impending transformation shall soon be palpable as my presence reigns supreme dispelling malevolent forces that have sought to bring distress. Seek me earnestly, and you shall discover rest for your soul within the confines of my promises and the sanctuary of my word, where your trust finds its abode. I am your God, your steadfast rock, your source of health, strength, and salvation. Grasp my hand firmly, and the foundation beneath you shall remain unshaken, for I am your protector, your Lord, your healer. Declare with unwavering conviction that your belief in me is steadfast. Cling with the entirety of your heart to your faith in me, for I love you unconditionally. I have been with you. I am with you. 
and I shall forever be with you. I implore you to lift your family in prayer. Your prayers are not merely uttered into the void, but are effective and powerful. Witness how I have responded to your presence before my altar. The challenges that have beset your family may not always be evident on their faces, for beneath the smiles they endure internal struggles. Come humbly before my altar, kneel in intercession, and let your cries be heard. I shall encircle your family with a protective hedge, rendering the adversary incapable of assailing them. I shall deliver them from afflictions and mishaps, infusing wisdom into their hearts. The doors that were once sealed shall be flung open, revealing myriad opportunities that were once concealed. Strength, peace, serenity, and inspiration shall be bestowed upon them, fostering tender communication that avoids hurtful words. They shall truly fathom the sentiments of their loved ones and comprehend the arduous situations they too endure. When you find yourself in the comforting presence of your loved ones, let tender caresses grace their heads. As you extend this gesture, my benediction shall flow from your hands, like a gentle stream extracting all sorrow from the depths of their souls. Every chain that binds them shall shatter, and the soothing balm of healing shall be poured into the chambers of their hearts. In those moments, speak to them my word, a comforting melody, ensuring they never forget the promises I have woven into the tapestry of their lives. Let the resonance of my name echo through the walls of your home with reverence, and behold as problems gradually dissipate, making way for the undeniable reign of my presence within your family. A moment is destined to dawn upon you, filled with great joy, as you bear witness to the transformative journey of their lives. Their character shall evolve, and those who once seemed lost will find their path, arriving at the blessed destination I have ordained for them. Hence, I encourage you to cling to me, resolute and undeterred by the negative circumstances that may unfold before you. Rest assured, for I hold within the grasp of my mighty hands a plan that unfailingly materializes, impervious to any obstruction. Yet, I entrust this sacred task to someone in your home, someone fervently believing in me, praying with unwavering faith and devotion, and that someone is none other than you. Engage in heartfelt prayers for your family and witness the miraculous obliteration of obstacles. The echoes of your prayers shall resonate in the realms of the heavenly, paving the way for triumph and victory. My love extends to you and to each member of your family. Find solace in me, for within my hands I cradle your present, your future, and the blessings predestined for your life. This is the tangible evidence of my choice, for I have chosen you. If you hold firm to the treasures embedded in my word, those who harbor intentions of seeing you ashamed will stand in awe as I unfold supernatural miracles within you. In these appointed days, I lift the countenance of your spirit, gently wiping away the tears that may have marked your journey, and I grant you a profound peace that transcends understanding. Happiness shall permeate your life, drawing you closer to me. Come, my cherished one, and lend your ears to my promises every single day. Open your Bible, find solace in silent reflection, read, and let the words nourish your hungry heart. Feel the surge of strength that courses through your being as I fortify you from within. At times, you may have lifted your eyes in hopeful anticipation of a response from the heavens. Today, however, I command you to redirect your gaze forward, for I am already answering your prayers and petitions. The things you have earnestly sought from me, I am graciously granting in accordance with my divine will. Within the sacred walls of your home, let someone rise with unwavering belief in me, praying sincerely with every fiber of their being and maintaining faith without faltering that someone is undoubtedly you. Engage fervently in prayers for your family and witness as I enshroud them with the celestial army that surrounds my divine throne. Guard against the intrusion of doubts clouding your mind, for my love for you is unwavering. Your life rests securely in my hands, and my desire is to guide you through these challenges, empowering you to conquer discouragement, focus resolutely on the future, and forge ahead without losing faith, ensuring your triumph and prosperity. 
Place your trust in me as your heavenly father and feel the boundless liberty to engage in heartfelt conversations. I desire to be more than a distant deity. I yearn for you to perceive me as a great friend. My hand is always extended towards you, a constant source of support and solace. Speak to me with your own lips. Share the intricacies of your needs, thoughts, plans, and deepest desires. Allow the flow of your feelings to become a river of communion, for through this dialogue, your soul finds solace and your mind experiences tranquility. As you articulate your emotions with your own words, the activation of your faith becomes a catalyst, setting in motion a cascade of miracles that shall unfold. Today is the day to lay bare your heart, sharing every thought and sentiment with me. Understand, dear child, that my spirit gently whispers in your ear, not to judge, scold, or remind you of past failures, but to convey an eternal love. I eagerly await each morning, anticipating the moment your eyes open and your thoughts declare your need for me and the love you hold. These expressions are not mere words. They are your worship, your praise, ascending to my heavenly throne. As the sun rises, my presence fills your life, your family, and the entirety of your dwelling. In the midst of the challenges that surround you, remember that I stand ready to assist. I will not withhold the blessings you request. Rather, I will answer promptly, enveloping them in the warmth of my boundless love. Entrust me with your thoughts and your heart. Place in my hands the concerns that erode your faith and cloud your dreams. The storms that brew in your mind need not be endured any longer, for my steadfast love is an unyielding anchor, grounding you in the face of despair. Whose words will you heed amidst the cacophony of voices? Will it be the cries of despondency, the lies of failure, or the affectionate words spoken by my voice? Know that you need not wallow in sorrow. For time and again I have shown that if you believe in my word, the gates of heaven shall swing open for you. You are my cherished child, and darkness shall not be your dwelling place. My spirit accompanies and comforts you wherever you go and it is no mere coincidence that you hear these words now. I have witnessed the conflicts that have punctuated your life, the wounds inflicted by adversaries of the past, and the reasons for your enduring suffering. Yet, I have come not to condemn but to rescue you from this agony, to shield you with the shelter of my wings, and to cover you with the reassuring shadow of my eternal love. Listen closely, read attentively, and believe wholeheartedly for I desire to see an end to your suffering. What you are going through is not a manifestation of my anger or displeasure. Rather, it is a testament to my enduring love for you forever. Let it be crystal clear that my purpose is to elevate you definitively, to mend the wounds of your despair, and liberate you from the shackles of failure. Summon the strength within, rise even if weariness persists, and take steps towards your blessing even when pain and wounds linger. Walk with faith once more, embracing the belief that miraculous healing awaits you. The moment you choose to place your trust in me, with each stride, you shall find renewed strength and experience complete healing. Rise at this very moment, for your life is on the brink of transformation. Do you grasp why? It's because of my unwavering love, standing faithfully by your side. That's all you need to know. Although today may bring disheartenment and sorrow as you immerse yourself in my words, your heart will swell with peace, joy, encouragement, and faith. Allow me a request as well. I implore you to remember my sweet love throughout this day, recalling it frequently. Yet those painful memories that have marred your life, cast them away from your thoughts. Ahead lie days of prayer and recovery, where lost blessings shall find their way back to you. I shall swing open doors that remain shut, pouring from heaven many blessings to bring prosperity and solace to your soul. From this day forward, walk with the conviction that I, your God, your heavenly Father, omnipotent and brimming with love for you, shall always be by your side. Let the fire within you burn bright, propelling you to lead a purposeful life with zeal and determination. Feel the burning desire to follow your King's commandments and never be ashamed to believe in me and in my word. Rejoice as you witness the unfolding miracles in your life 
and the lives of your family. Those who believe in me have the right to be heard in my presence, reaping the fruits of their faith and obedience. Expect miraculous wonders soon. Anticipate positive changes in the lives of your loved ones, filling you with joy. So, even if you encounter occasional problems and difficulties, remain assured that I shall never part from you. I am with you in every moment and situation. I yearn to assist you. Speak to me with confidence and faith, and be prepared to listen. My written word shall speak directly to your heart, infusing you with my spirit. Rest assured that nothing and no one can snatch away the newfound strength I have bestowed upon you. Pledge with your own lips that you will seek me every day with love and faith, for I await you. You can be certain of my love for you. I come to you today, reaching out to speak directly to your heart, precisely when you need me the most. My love for you knows no bounds. It is genuine, unconditional, and eternal. Not even your sins or mistakes can sever the ties of this profound love that I feel for you. Even if you've distanced yourself from me, my compassionate hand extends towards you, liberating you from the chains that bound you and stole your zest for life. Whenever you call upon me, I am present. In moments of desperation, I open wide the doors of my heart to welcome you. As I see you kneel in prayer, my gaze upon you is filled with tenderness. My grace surrounds you, even as you navigate perilous and bitter paths. My presence serves as a radiant light, illuminating your life amidst the darkest moments. Before you took form in your mother's womb, I knew you intimately. The exact time, the precise second, and the day of your birth were chosen by me. Nothing unfolds in your life without my will or approval. Even if, at times, you may find yourself at odds with what I am orchestrating, one day, you will come to realize that it was for your ultimate good, to fortify you, foster your growth, and because I always have something better in store for you. My plan is to elevate you to a higher realm of faith and surrender. I desire to place in your hands the resplendent sword of my soul, so that when you speak my word, miraculous wonders shall unfold around you. Reject the notion that you are undeserving of the blessings I wish to bestow upon you. Let go of those thoughts. Recognize your true identity, a child of the omnipotent God, a valiant and resilient warrior endowed with strength, determination, and victory. Embrace this truth, for it is the outcome of receiving and embracing my love. You are not destined for defeat. Beyond the tribulations that you will conquer through your faith, a beautiful blessing of victory awaits you. Embrace my presence as it encompasses every aspect of your journey. Envision it as a luminous shroud of light enveloping both you and your surroundings. I guide you to maintain an awareness of me in every circumstance you encounter. In moments of uncertainty or solitude, remember that my presence is a constant source of comfort, akin to a sheltering canopy of stars in the night sky. Reflect upon the story of Jacob, finding respite on a stone in a barren land. In his dreams, he witnessed a vision of heaven angels, and receive promises of my enduring presence. His awakening led to the realization, truly, the Lord is in this place, and I was unaware. This revelation transcends biblical times. It is a timeless truth for all who earnestly seek me. When you sense a distance or disconnection, proclaim with boldness. Undoubtedly, the divine is present in this space. Extend an invitation for me to unveil your eyes and open your heart to my perpetual guidance. This earnest plea fills my being with joy, and I respond eagerly. Throughout every stride in your life's odyssey, I stand by your side, whether you navigate through challenges or revel in moments of joy. Be mindful that my presence is an unwavering companion. In the hush of your contemplative moments, listen for my whisper that reassures you of my boundless love and unwavering guidance. Allow this assurance to fortify the bedrock of your faith. When life's intricacies threaten to overwhelm, anchor yourself in this uncomplicated yet profound truth. Undoubtedly, the divine is present in this place. As you engage in your daily routines, 
Let each passing moment serve as a gentle reminder of my steadfast love and presence, transcending both the mundane and the extraordinary, embracing your triumphs and trials alike. I am there. My presence is not merely a source of solace. It embodies a promise of resilience, direction, and hope. So, request my presence to illuminate the tapestry of your life, an entreaty that brings me immense joy to fulfill. Always remember, you tread not alone in the labyrinth of life, whether navigating through dense thickets of doubt or ascending the most formidable mountains of challenges. My hand is there, poised to guide and steady you. In the serenity of your soul, find me articulating words of sagacity and tranquility. My voice resonates not only in the thunderous storms, but also in the gentle zephyrs and the calming hues of the setting sun. Each experience woven into the fabric of your life holds purpose and intent. Place your trust in my meticulously crafted plan, woven with boundless love and endless wisdom. In moments of uncertainty, seek solace in my timeless promises. Allow my words to serve as a luminous beacon, guiding you through the obscurity towards a dawn illuminated by comprehension and peace. Therefore, as you traverse the journey of life, let this truth be your unyielding fortress and source of solace. Undoubtedly, the divine is in this place. May it stand as a wellspring of strength and tranquility for you today and always. When a fundamental need is absent, be it time, energy, or money, consider it a blessing. Your perceived lack is not a deficiency, but a chance to cling to me with unwavering dependence. As you commence each day with what may seem like insufficient resources, channel your focus on the present moment, where life unfolds and where I patiently await your presence. Acknowledging your own insufficiency is a profound blessing guiding you to place wholehearted trust in me. Recognize that self-sufficiency is an illusion, often propped up by pride and fleeting triumphs. The trappings of health and wealth, though seemingly tangible, can dissipate as swiftly as life itself can transform. Embrace your inadequacies, finding joy in the process. In your moments of weakness and need, my power is most vividly displayed and perfected. This is a call to shift your perspective. In the eyes of the world, lacking something may appear as a failure or shortfall. However, in my divine economy, these moments of lack serve as opportunities for deeper faith and reliance on my strength. When you feel drained and your resources appear scarce, that is when my presence becomes more tangible and my support becomes clearer. In moments of insufficiency, when your own well of strength and resources runs dry, turn to me. It is during these times that my power, grace, and love flow abundantly into your life. These are the moments when your faith expands and matures, and your dependence on me transforms from a mere concept to a tangible, lived experience. Through life's highs and lows, remember that my strength shines most brilliantly in your weakness. Do not despair when faced with situations seemingly beyond your capacity. Rejoice in your human limitations, as they are opportunities for my power to manifest in your life. In your insufficiency, my sufficiency becomes more evident. In your weakness, my strength is perfected. Therefore, step boldly into each day, not disheartened by what you lack, but encouraged by the understanding that in your weakness, you are strong for I am with you. My power and grace are more than enough for you, and in your weaknesses, my glory shines most brightly. Embrace each new day, not as a constant struggle against inadequacy, but as a unique opportunity to immerse yourself in the boundless depths of my love and power. This, at its core, is the essence of faith. Discovering resilience in weakness, discovering sufficiency in insufficiency, and uncovering strength in dependency. In this divine paradox, you'll encounter the purest expression of my love and power actively at work within your life. Therefore, rejoice in your vulnerabilities, for they serve as conduits for the most profound transformations I orchestrate within you. I am here to invigorate you, align your priorities, and fueled by your faith in my word, 
restore health to your body. Immerse your thoughts in the rejuvenating stream of youth. Rediscover the vigor of your youth and engage your body as you did in your younger years. Through your transformation, you will inspire countless young souls. Believe in my boundless love for you and acknowledge my desire for your enduring happiness. I hold the power to bring joy, harmony to your family, and a future overflowing with blessings. I am determined to make it happen, and the strength to achieve this lies within me. If you have heeded my guidance thus far, prepare yourself. Shake off the dust of past failures that have aged your spirit. You can overcome, for you are not alone. Your love and belief in me will bear witness to my transformative power through your family and your life. Draw away from those who strike you with discouraging words and attitudes. Do not revisit friendships and places that once led you astray. I implore you not to let the warmth of your spirit turn cold as ice again. A future of life, peace, and blessings awaits you. Devoid of sorrow and depression if you prioritize me at the center of your life. Stay unwavering in the word I provide, making me the sovereign of your heart. Within your mind, countless plans and aspirations reside. Such is your nature. Fear not. You are a highly responsible and diligent individual. Trust wholly in me, and you shall thrive. Seek me each day, heeding the guidance within my word. Take bold strides, anchoring your dreams in the bedrock of faith, and establish your own family according to my will and counsel. I know you comprehend this deeply. I ask not for too much but implore you to fix your gaze on things of genuine value. Refrain from squandering time and energy on fanciful illusions and fruitless pursuits. Your paramount concern should be your relationship with me. Do not sever the connection between us. I eagerly await the moment when you listen to me in silence, for I yearn to converse with you. Witnessing your growth brings me immense joy. You've become stronger and your dreams and efforts truly delight me. Abundant blessings await you, and rest assured, I have positioned you precisely in the right time and place. You stand ready for me to unlock the doors I have promised. Approach each one with courage, undeterred by challenges. Widen your eyes, for beyond each problem lies a realm of blessings reserved for courageous souls like yours. Those who comprehend their inherent worth, dismissing threats and words of failure or defeat. I do not wish to witness your failure, for I have paid the price for all your sins. Now is the moment to open your heart to my grace and embrace my forgiveness. Despite those fervently desiring your downfall, they will soon witness how I can assist you in triumphing and achieving success despite their ill intentions. Come with me now and we shall journey together. Place your unyielding trust in me. Allow my love to empower and transform you. There is no room for sorrow or fear when you are cradled in the palm of my hand. I watch over you eternally. Fear not your adversaries. I am your shield. When faced with those who rise against you as a valiant warrior, I shall extend my hand to you and lift you high, ensuring your victory. The time has arrived to entrust your future to me and stand tall. Today, I present you with an indisputable plan. Surrender your life into my hands. Offer me your entire being. Whether faced with towering mountains or traversing deep valleys, I will guide you and clear your paths. Yet I ask you to exert effort and display courage, taking resolute steps even in the valley of shadows, through darkness, or across tumultuous waters. Fear not, do not search for excuses to abandon your dreams. You shall not waver. You will persist. Even when awareness grips you, exert yourself further, for I have granted you the strength and capability to overcome despondency and break free from the habit of placing blame on others for everything. For my love surpasses your mistakes and poor decisions. There's no need to wait for suffering to draw you back to me. Come to me now, and I will embrace you lovingly, revealing the depths of my love. Today, I await you. Your future and current situation will improve. I will intervene in your life supernaturally, soon, and with your own eyes, you will witness the clear solution to your difficulties. Do not align yourself with those who trust in negativity 
or the opinions of those who choose to dwell in spiritual misery. If you find yourself hearing or reading these words, it's because I've endowed you with intelligence. You've grown, you're prepared, and soon the door will swing open. I am no figment of imagination. You know me, you recognize who I am. Cease doubting my word. In moments of trouble, I've consistently reached out to rescue you with my holy hand, enveloping you with love and bestowing life upon you, despite a tumultuous past. Following each rescue, your present has consistently improved. Allow the fire in your heart to blaze. The dream I've planted is flourishing, evolving into a tree that provides shade, abundant provision, and prosperity for you and your loved ones. Loved. The imminent arrival of my presence draws near, urging you to cast aside any doubts about being a product of mere chance. Even if the love from others has eluded you, understand that my love for you surpasses all in the universe. I implore you to believe in me, summon the courage to rise, and welcome my blessings, so you may share them with boundless joy. Each dawn, as you open your eyes, I will illuminate the way for you. Enter into my presence, and I shall unveil my plans. I will fill you with wisdom, aiding your comprehension of the journey that has shaped the person you are today. If envy seeks to assail you, stand firm. When weakness or illness threatens, call upon me for strength and healing. In moments of discouragement, remember that I reside within you, and your body is the sanctuary of my Holy Spirit. I shall never distance myself, abandon you, or leave you in solitude. Let not your emotions mislead you. I have been with you, unchanging, yesterday, today, and forever. My love for you remains unwavering. Widen your eyes each day, for I will unveil novel ways to demonstrate my love for you. You are enveloped in a supernatural abundance of grace. Soon, the very things you have sought will rest in your hands. Rise, my champion of faith, for I love you. Good morning and thank you for attuning your ears to these words. They bring you tranquility. Listen to them once more, absorbing each letter. Feel my presence beside you, caressing your heart, instilling calmness, my beloved one. You are never alone, and as long as you remain with me, no harm shall befall you. Be at peace. Close your eyes, refrain from weeping, for your breath will not run out. Each time you converse with me, your needs are conveyed through tears, yet my voice heals and consoles you. It dispels anxiety, and my tender embrace dries your tears, cocooning you in serenity. Tarry a while longer. It is not time for your departure. I desire your soul to depart fortified, whether you encounter valleys of shadows or deserts. You will sense the constant protection of my eternal love, day and night. Feel it, embrace it, and believe in it. To those who stand against you with deceit and take advantage, they become adversaries of mine as well. Those who oppose you shall be vanquished, and they will not reclaim what they believe they have taken from you. Fear not. Even in the face of apparent loss, you will not be defeated. Have faith, for everything unfolds for a reason, and I always have the best in store for you. Maintain a spirit of courage and conviction, resisting the clutches of fear and despair. Your future is one adorned with goodness and blessings. I know this truth enveloped in my eternal peace and love. Your family is under my protective embrace, and I shall generously reward you for dedicating this moment of your day to me. As you rise, supernatural strength shall accompany you. I will expand your understanding and spiritual vision, unveiling the wondrous blessings that await you. Keep that radiant smile upon your face. It brings me boundless joy when you appear well. In the twilight hours, you resemble me, and I eagerly anticipate seeing you again for your well-being. Your soul is a tapestry of beauty, and I admire your demeanor. Your feelings during our conversations and the moments you close your eyes resonate deeply with me. I cherish your tender heart, pulsating with the rhythm of joy, saturated with divine happiness as I soothe your being, dispelling any discomfort, pain, or illness after you lend me your ears. Let the words I've just spoken resonate within your very soul, for you will need to cling to them when tongues that seek to discourage you launch their attacks. Understand that I am the one who brings healing, prosperity, and rescue to your life. 
covering you with an abundance of love and mercy. I swing wide open the door to a supernatural realm. It is my fervent desire that you receive the miracles you earnestly request of me. However, I also command you to hold them close to your heart. Your efforts please me, and I cherish the way you seek me out. Your prayers and expressions of gratitude are music to my ears, bringing happiness as I witness your courageous demeanor. Revisit these words, for they are meant to be etched into the fabric of your soul. In times when discouragement seeks to assail you, you will need to summon these affirmations. Acknowledge that I am the one who brings healing, prosperity, and rescue to your life, enveloping you with love and mercy, drawing the very breath you inhale from the depths of your heart. Your life and your family stand as a divine testimony to my boundless love. Take a moment to reflect on the places, times, pains, and sufferings from which I have delivered you. You may not have been born into opulence, but from the moment you first glimpsed the light, you became one of my messengers, destined to bring healing to this world. Yet, there is a revelation I wish to share with you. The adversary sought to wrest away your calling. My celestial angelic armies swooped in to defend you, engaging in a fierce battle. You bore the relentless lashes of hatred assaulting your very essence. Yet, I arrived with love, your true father, the only one who supports and uplifts you to fulfill your purpose and mission. Today, as you heed my decision, just as you demonstrated unwavering faith and strength in the face of pain, you shall now adopt a triumphant attitude. Do not allow anyone to undermine your determination. Place your trust solely in my word, guided by the promises I convey to you. You know that you belong to me. I shall envelop you with my love and personally confront any enemy daring to oppose you. Dismiss those thoughts that encircle you when problems arise. If conflicts mount, if weariness sets in, if numerous decisions weigh on you and your spirit falters, come and rest. Rest assured that in my presence, you shall find solace and hope. The accumulation of your problems shall not diminish the protection bestowed by my love. Understand that I did not send those situations to you. I assure you that from where you stand, you shall emerge with my powerful hand. I shall rescue you, for I have never wished for you to suffer beyond your capabilities. I shall lift the heavy burdens from your shoulders. It is not my desire for you to dwell in solitude and sorrow. Your future is so magnificent that your enemies seek ways to obstruct your blessings. In this battle, you hold the key, and your faith is a sword that shatters obstacles in your path. You shall only falter if you open the door to negative thoughts and emotions sent your way by your enemies. However, you shall triumph if my Holy Spirit takes precedence in your life and your heart. I have fulfilled my part. I have secured salvation for you, an inheritance of victory and blessing. Now remain steadfast, as you have done. I convey this message to you just in time. You stand on the brink of reaching a spiritual level where miracles unfold in your daily journey. Do not regress. You have covered much ground. Do not dismiss the tears you shed or the sacrifices you made. Within the walls of your home, my divine message must resonate. Commence your day with a concise and heartfelt prayer. Acknowledge that you may be occupied with important affairs, but do not let considerable time elapse without engaging in conversation with me. I yearn to offer guidance, and I will do so when met with an attitude of gratitude and faith. You will uncover straightforward paths leading to triumph, and I will unveil the enigmatic insights concealed in your future. You shall receive signs, and my voice will resonate within you. Together with your family, we shall navigate through conflicts and tribulations. Every dawn you will be assured that my Holy Spirit and supernatural vigor dwell within you. With me by your side, who can impede your progress? If you embrace my teachings, your blessings will not evade you. If you honor me in every endeavor, the gates of heaven will unfold, showering you with abundant wisdom and tranquility. Genuine prosperity and wealth that bring no sorrow will cascade upon you. Opportunities fostering growth and tranquility will grace your path. Many may speak of miracles, yet fail to present evidence. Others may profess to receive revelations, yet their actions bear no fruit. Their lives and families stand as no testament to my boundless love. 
No human on this earthly plane possesses ownership of my teachings. Do not entrust your future to hollow promises. If you seek love, patience, and wisdom, if you yearn to deepen your understanding of me, come forth and I will unveil my divine purpose. I am your path, your truth, your life, your compassionate shepherd, your redeemer, your savior, your healer. I am your God and Lord, but never forget. I am also your father. I embody love, and my desire is for your freedom and triumph. I long to witness your growth in knowledge, free from the shackles of financial curses. Your well-being from head to toe and that of your family matter deeply to me. I seek to provide you with both physical and spiritual stability, fostering your mental health and overall happiness. You hold immeasurable value in my eyes, surpassing your own estimation. Reflect on those dreams that once illuminated your room, the excitement that kept you awake with plans and aspirations. Embrace the wisdom that may come with the passage of time, yet remain enthused about pursuing your dreams anew. Nourish your prayers with praise. Bring thanksgiving to my altar. Value and appreciate all you receive, even if it be something modest. Though I may not grant your exact requests, comprehend that I always provide something far superior. I am your Father and Creator. I discern what is best for your future, your family, your spiritual life, and your heart. If you seek prosperity, I shall erase your debts. Be grateful, you now dwell in freedom. Perhaps your accounts hold no currency at this moment, but no one will arrive at your door seeking repayment. If you seek abundance, I shall offer employment and dignified work for every member of your household. Complain not. I am supplying you with the means and the path to earn your sustenance. Fear not, I shall unlock doors for you. Proceed to the place I guide you, for their prosperity shall accompany your dedication and honor. I desire to pour abundant blessings into your life, so you may learn how to steward them wisely. Merge your grateful heart with the wisdom bestowed upon you, and you shall receive many magnificent and wondrous things. Peace in your home is also my desire. Let the miracles you witness become catalysts for your spiritual growth. However, do not lose sight of my word. Do not fixate solely on material possessions. Above all, maintain a genuine attitude of gratitude within you. This is the initial step toward a supernatural life. These are the keys that unlock the door to an era of abundance. Your devotion, worship, expressions of gratitude, unwavering faith, and your commitment to bestow blessings upon those around you, along with your yearning to receive my word, your persistence in prayer and your eagerness to be an instrument of my grace to construct a better world. All these things bring immense joy to my heart. Behold the value I bestow upon you and the enduring love I harbor, which shall not diminish due to your shortcomings or the multitude of your troubles. I shall pluck you from the pit into which you have fallen and extend my hand to elevate you to a new realm of spiritual strength. You are exceedingly precious to me. I must convey this truth to you. As the morning sun ascends, you shall remember me. My rays will pierce through your window, and you will discern the freshness of my mercy, sensing my spirit urging you to engage in prayer. Confide your feelings with me. Share your plans and fears and I shall reaffirm my word, responding to your petitions. Above all, realize that every moment offered in sincere faith will be met with my embrace filled with love, providing the assurance you need to navigate your days. I have consumed the pages where your tears were inscribed in crimson ink. I have erased your transgressions from my memory and removed the sources of your sorrow from your heart forever. You are liberated, truly free, Affirm your belief, pen these words on paper. I am free forever because of this love. Your freedom has not been earned, nor have you achieved it through perfection. You are not subject to ill fate, and no sorcery, evil spirits, or witchcraft hold dominion over you. I implore you to grasp this truth, and if belief falters, read and listen again. Neither you nor your loved ones fall under the influence of malevolent forces. All wickedness is defeated. Every chain has been shattered and every bond annihilated. I address you today because I've witnessed you deviate from your destined path, 
swayed by the opinions of others that label you as undeserving of my love. If you place more trust in their words, finding their power to be greater, it deeply offends me. Repent, for I love you, and I am proving it to you right where you are now. Your heart cries out because you recognize that my word is reaching you at the precise moment. Choose to believe in me. Tomorrow, as you awaken, you will cast aside thoughts of failure. No one has you bound, and you shall fear no threats. You embark on the initial steps toward a life of joy and blessings, of peace and divine abundance. On your table, there will be bread, sustenance for those you love, health within your family, and tranquility within your home. Welcome the new day with life, with happiness free from fear, with a smile void of anxiety, with serenity untouched by trepidation, and with unwavering faith. I am with you, and I love you. Separate yourself today from those who regard you with disdain. Do it for your family. Accept my love and grant me the place I rightfully deserve in your heart. Clasp onto the life I've granted you. Saturate yourself with even greater joy. Numerous transformative events will unfold soon, altering your perspective and revealing my intricate plans for you. Despite past stumbles, I've remained steadfast by your side, forgiving, lifting you up, and never leaving you defeated or abandoned. New days are on the horizon. Your sadness will dissipate, replaced by infinite happiness, and a miracle will manifest shortly. Through my power, you'll witness it firsthand. Declare your faith and commitment now, affirming, I believe in it. As I consistently express, I love you. Hold on to your faith, you will not sink. I am testing you with minor challenges to bestow upon you great blessings. I comprehend your suffering, your pain. Amidst your despair, my spirit consoles your soul, quenching the thirst of your heart. Continue to shed tears of joy. Savor this moment. Embrace this immense and sacred emotion. I am pouring overwhelming joy over you, washing away all the suffering you endured. Soon, my answer to your prayers will arrive. I will provide the best, nourishing your soul, keeping you close to me. Nothing shall snatch you away from my love. Cease struggling, you are wearing yourself out. It is better to close your eyes for a moment, surrender all anxieties to me. Lay the burden of your worries at my feet. Your passion will not be in vain. You will not be defeated, you will not be put to shame. I will assist you in your requests. I urge you to shield your heart and not attach importance to the words of those who long to witness your downfall. Do not permit them to plant seeds of discouragement in your soul. Distance yourself from those who wish to see you in sorrow, from those who assert your lack of worth. Your belief in me affirms your value. I come to emphasize the vastness of my love and all that I desire to unfold for you. I sense that today, you are perceiving my presence in a profound way, and henceforth, this awareness will intensify daily. You shall triumph over your conflicts, attain freedom and be blessed. I shall mend your wounds, alleviate the pain in your bones, and eradicate the feelings that afflict you. I will uplift you, infusing you with holy joy and happiness. I shall wipe away the tears from your eyes, restoring a beautiful smile to your lips. Through your words, you will sing and proclaim your love for me. Those who held you in contempt will witness and acknowledge that my hand has graciously preserved you. You will stand firm in the place of blessing, where I have firmly planted you. Your roots will delve deep, and none can uproot you. I comprehend that you cannot extricate yourself from eternal punishment. Your freedom and debts are settled, your victory is assured. My promises are steadfast, sealed with immense, profound, and exquisite love. Do not seek to fathom, live it, feel it, resonate with it. This wondrous love inundates your heart. Despite disappointments in love from others, I, the creator of the universe, am here, seeking you out to express the profound depth of my love for you. I share these profound sentiments with you through unexpected channels. There's no need to venture to distant lands or scale mountains to hear my voice. I long to touch your heart in this very moment, right here and now. Even if you initially resist, 
you already sense the vast love meant for you. My love is so profound that I will never permit you to drift away from me. Embrace this new chapter without the weight of loneliness or fear, cradled in my affection, sailing in the vast ocean of happiness with my love. Steer your course towards the harbor where you shall receive the crown of victory, blessed with eternal joy, prosperity, and sacred riches. To bring about a change in your life, relinquish all disbelief. The enemy assails your mind with doubts as he wishes to keep you from knowing me better and witnessing how all my promises come to fruition. Realize that your trials, however formidable, are transitory. They are sculpting you, refining you, and preparing you for the treasures that await in heaven. Treasures that are imperishable and eternal. In the crucible of trial, your faith is solidifying, your character is taking shape, and your heart is aligning more closely with mine. Trust in the journey I've charted for you, even when the path seems shrouded in uncertainty. In every trial, a seed of victory lies hidden, a victory that blossoms not from evading challenges, but from enduring and conquering them with me by your side. When life presents its trials, it's natural to feel shaken, questioning the reasons behind the adversity, wondering if you've somehow earned these challenges. Such reactions stem from the innate human desire to comprehend and control our circumstances. Yet, as I conveyed to my disciples during the night of my arrest, in this world, you will face troubles. They are as inevitable as the air you breathe and the water you drink. However, amidst these challenges, you possess a unique comfort and peace, unfamiliar to the rest of the world. You have me. In my embrace, you discover a sanctuary, a strength that transcends earthly trials, for I have triumphed over the world. This isn't just a historical triumph, it's an enduring truth resonating through your life today. Your trials, no matter how sudden or severe, never catch me off guard. They lack the power to overcome me or derail my eternal purposes for you. Doubt not my word. When I make a promise, it is inscribed and shall be fulfilled. The extent to which I am willing to go for you surpasses comprehension. My love transcends the boundaries of the universe. I shall enfold you with tenderness, bless your dwelling, and send forth my divine rain to nourish your fields. Daily, you shall reap the fruits with gratitude. Your self-assurance will soar, evident in your unwavering stance against adversaries. I shall stand beside you, aiding you in overcoming, causing them to retreat as they witness my formidable power within you. Now is the moment to lift your gaze, shedding the weight of past offenses and mistreatment endured, while maintaining unwavering faith in me. Refrain from lowering your eyes and losing sight of the wonders I have yet to reveal to you. Lift your countenance and bask in the blessings destined for you, for I, your Creator, have chosen to share my magnificent promises with you. As your Maker, the architect of the seen and unseen, I solemnly pledge to always be with you, showering you with my most splendid blessings. My love for you spans eternity. Your resilience astounds me. I urged you to be strong, yet you surpassed my request. You exemplify loyalty and fidelity, and I am overjoyed to witness the beautiful fruits that have blossomed from the seeds I planted within you. This is why a season of prosperity and new horizons is unfolding for you, surpassing your desires and dreams. You shall press forward until you conquer the land where blessings and happiness abound. I acknowledge that at times you perceive things differently. Your emotions swell when faced with envy and rejection, even from those who profess love for you. Instead of recognizing your virtues, they seek ways to bring you down, delving into the past to resurrect memories meant to wound and shatter your spirit. Envious individuals may seek to remind you of past mistakes, attempting to cast shadows upon you with the weight of your sins. Pay no heed to their attempts. Do not allow bitterness and sorrow to consume your spirit. Even if the world abandons you, rest assured, I will always stand by your side. My unwavering presence is yours, and you shall forever remain the beautiful, tender, and sincere soul that I cherish deeply. Do not waste precious moments on idle gossipers who know nothing of those they speak about. 
Seek my presence, yearn for my word, and find solace in my boundless love. With meticulous care, I crafted all things, the oceans, the skies, the mountains, and your soul, so that you may find everlasting residence in my kingdom. The days of the wicked are fleeting, but yours shall endure indefinitely. I have granted everyone the freedom to choose between life and truth. When I touched your heart, your gratitude resonated with me. Abundant blessings await, and we shall always journey together. Have faith and banish fear. Those who accuse you of past mistakes and sins waste time, for I have already forgiven you, erasing them from memory. Your sins, cast deep into the sea, are now lifted from your mind. The lingering secret sadness in your heart will be transformed. Your attitude shall change, and I desire to see you rise with profound enthusiasm to face life. The most extraordinary blessings are reserved for those who truly believe in me, holding my word with humble hearts, never letting this power go to their heads. With the unwavering faith that courses through your veins, you shall rise, alive and aware, that you are a cherished child of the Creator of the universe. Each step you take exudes confidence, and witnessing your steadfast character, boundless gratitude, and the beauty within your heart profoundly moves me. As the sun prepares to dawn on a new day, I eagerly anticipate embracing you once more with my boundless love. In the quiet moments before daylight, as you awaken, I am already by your side, showering you with abundant blessings. I gift you the very air you breathe, the, the radiant light that illuminates your soul, and the resilience of character to conquer and forge a hid, despite the limitations and obstacles life presents. I am your omnipotent God, equipped with the power to guide you through the intricate mazes and entanglements that impede your happiness. Should you permit me to act according to my divine will, I can fortify your emotions, dispel your fears, and assure your heart that you are not inferior to anyone. If doubts about your worth linger, if those around you pass judgment or criticize, it does not provide a reason or excuse for my love to waver. Your countenance will radiate my holiness, and your words will possess a healing and restorative power. Your decisions will reflect wisdom, and your fruits will be good. Those who have strayed will aspire to emulate you, but find it beyond their reach. While I extended love and blessings to them, they chose to reject me and forge their own path. As they persist in the path of error, you walk the righteous path, reaping numerous blessings. They may sprint towards the abyss of sadness and perdition, but you will march forward without glancing back. Focus solely on what lies ahead, leaving the past in my care. Extend your hand towards your future, entrusting all your plans to me. Seek my word and kneel daily to receive my guidance. Henceforth, Anticipate only miracles and triumphs. Life's journey isn't effortless, and challenges will surface, but my love blankets you, and my power aids you in navigating through problems. Fear not, press onward. Victory is your destiny. Counter those who oppose you with sweetness. Do not let doubt take root from those mired in defeat due to their own choices. They have expelled me from their hearts dedicating themselves to sowing discouragement. Be discerning about whose words you heed. My wish is that your faith remains ablaze, that you never lose sight of your true identity. I have bestowed upon you life, happiness, renewed purpose, a reservoir of peace and an expansion of wisdom. Direct your focus towards yourself and your family, steering clear of the quest to appease the world's expectations or succumbing to the pressures imposed by others. Free yourself from the burden of feeling disheartened when faced with rejection or angered by someone's actions. Take a moment to grant me the opportunity to refine your character. In instances where offense is taken or peace is threatened, resist the urge to respond immediately. Instead, let your reaction be steeped in kindness, allowing my Holy Spirit to speak through your words amidst a world rife with confusion, where many offload their frustrations onto you due to the sight of your well-tended field and calm demeanor. Remain steadfast. I personally brandish the sword of my word, 
rebuking the enemy and his legions. I poured forth a sacred anointing of healing upon you, setting you on the course of your destiny. I guided you, charting a map adorned with countless dreams within your heart and carving out paths for you. I endowed you with gifts and talents, sculpting you into my valiant warrior. I breathed my life into your spirit, igniting a flame that never wanes. I equipped you to bring solace to nations, offering soul capsules to those in distress. Take hold of my hand and never forget that I will walk beside you, assuring you that you can achieve all your dreams. My deepest longing is to witness your happiness, which is why I am here to watch over you, protect you, and provide you with peace. My love for you is genuine and steadfast. Therefore, fear not, for I shall never abandon you. I am your counselor, your friend, and your guardian. I have moved heaven and earth to ensure your triumph. To those who rise against you, I address you. I am Jesus, your Savior and Redeemer. The day of your transformation is on the horizon. Tune your ear to the melody of my angels singing, heralding my imminent presence. I love you, and lo and behold, I am coming soon, very soon. Your past does not dictate your future, even in the midst of your world seemingly unraveling. You've clung to your faith in me, sought refuge in my arms, and in them you shall always find security. Embrace peace and joy, for you dwell in the comforting shadow of your almighty God. Believe in the transformative power of my blood to cleanse and forgive you. Hold on to this truth with all your heart. Open your eyes wide, for soon I will orchestrate a powerful and inspiring miracle in your life. Proclaim your love for me, believe in my divine power, and trust that I have indeed forgiven you. Do not bear the weight of blame or persist in self-punishment for the shadows of the past. I have cast all your sins into the abyss, a place from which they shall never return. My blood has washed over you, leaving your heart renewed and your mind reborn. Now saturate yourself with the essence of my holy word. Let words that resonate with my pleasure flow from your lips words filled with vitality and uplifting encouragement. Contemplate my promises and commandments daily. Refuse to tread back into the dark realms of death. Your footsteps are no longer aimless, and your future is not a product of mere luck. You rest in the shelter of my hands, beneath the protective wings that shield you. Even when the world launches its assaults, your mind remains resolute, fortified further, by embracing the truths I speak to you. Guard your tongue against ill-speaking. Do not propagate slander or false news. Refrain from speaking ill of loyal companions. If you have faltered, come into my presence. I forgive your transgressions. I cleanse your heart. Seek me in prayer each morning. I long to liberate your soul from guilt and remorse. I sacrifice my life as a beacon of light and resurrected so that you could be liberated from mental and spiritual suffering. Your humanity may lead your body, soul, and mind to fatigue in this world. Even my devoted servants faced weariness and errors, yet they humbly acknowledged their sins and returned to the altar of forgiveness. They rose to confront their battles and emerged victorious, without hesitation. Come to me now, if weariness burdens your spirit, if you feel you have stumbled or spoken thoughtlessly, if unintentional actions have wounded a loved one, or if harmful physical or mental habits ensnare you, if your love for me is genuine and you believe in my desire to assist you, come forth. I tenderly touch your lips, cleanse your heart, and you are forgiven. Do not return to the same pitfalls. I am renewing your spirit and motivation. You shall rise like a champion, leaving guilt and sorrow in your wake. Recall moments of joy, past victories, if you must remember something. Just as you exercise faith and overcame before, you shall do so again. With this loving embrace, I command you to face life with unwavering faith and determination. I am with you. I love you, my champion. Express how much love you need. I am present. Fill my vessel. Today, I can pour an immense rain of love over your life. My love for you is tender, sweet, invigorating, patient, and everlasting. The matters troubling you rest in my hands and I will resolve them. 
Believe in me wholeheartedly and trust your path to me daily. In my presence, cultivate faith and I will guide your steps. Awake each day with the flame of faith burning in your chest, a divine sensation transforming your soul, inspiring you, propelling you out of bed with a powerful purpose to face the day. Pour all your energy into your work, meet new people, and discover opportunities I place in your path. Delight me with the sparkle in your eyes as you receive my blessings. Cherish how you express gratitude with tears trickling down your cheeks, finding solace in your hands. Contemplate that pivotal moment when I faced arrest and Peter, in his zealousness, drew his sword. His instinct was to combat, to confront adversity with immediate and forceful action. Yet he couldn't grasp that the Father had a more profound purpose in that adversity, one vital not only for his redemption but for the salvation of all humanity. Peter's response reflects a common human inclination to swiftly escape trials, to seek rapid solutions, often through our own efforts. In my own journey, the Father's intention was not to avoid the trial, but to endure it. This endurance wasn't passive submission, but purposeful, active participation in the Father's divine plan. Similarly, when confronted with devastating trials, your instinct might push you to hastily resolve them. Yet, remember that the Father's intentions often surpass mere problem-solving. He might be weaving something far grander, aligned with an eternal perspective, even if it remains obscured at first. Walking beside me, grasp that ultimate victory is certain, even in the face of death. This triumph doesn't entail bypassing challenges, but transcending them through faith, perseverance, and trust in my plan. In moments of trial, resist succumbing to despair. Instead, turn to me, laying your burdens at my feet through prayer and fasting. Dwell in my words, a wellspring of strength and solace. Attend closely to the gentle guidance of the Holy Spirit. I have shaped you, breathed my essence into you, and bestowed upon you a wondrous authority. However, if reluctance hinders your progress, grounded in disbelief of my words, preferring the misguided counsel of false friends, that is another matter entirely. I yearn for your unwavering faith to thrive even further. Firmly believe in my love, my reality, and my will to shower you with love and blessings. Your life resides in my hands, your prosperity. I love you, and I implore you to profess your belief in me today. I recognize that your day may be overflowing with numerous tasks, but I take the initiative to propose a sacred moment of prayer between us. My desire is to gently nudge your heart, a gentle reminder of the wellspring from which all your blessings flow. In the hustle and bustle of your responsibilities, I wish to shield you from loosing your way, sparing you from the fatigue you and uncertainty that can sometimes linger at day's end. I yearn to infuse you with the strength to confront challenges, to face them with unwavering courage. Allow the radiance of your faith to illuminate your gaze and be assured of my constant presence by your side. I hope you embrace this truth, for it shall manifest as such. Even when doubts cloud your mind, doors will still open, yet a moment of hesitation born from disbelief might allow another to enter. It is crucial for you to rejuvenate your strength and the fervor that propels you to dream and labor diligently. Your faith, a guiding force, directs you towards a brighter destination. You've held steadfast in your beliefs and perseverance on this path, but be aware the adversary prowls like a roaring lion, targeting those who harbor doubt and distraction. Your steps must be resolute, and your indomitable spirit will carry you through, emerging triumphant. Seek and love me in prosperity, but even in the face of adversity and chaos, continue your journey in prayers. Persevere through tears, whether they be rain or storm, and I shall calm the tempests and silence the seas. I will command your conflicts to cease, and I will attend to your tribulations. Yet I yearn for an unwavering commitment to loving and seeking me always, granting me the foremost place in all your endeavors. Witness this faith transform into a mighty sword that vanquishes evil, conquers weaknesses, and provides spiritual and supernatural strength, empowering you to overcome temptations, fears, problems, 
and all challenges that cross your path. Before stepping outside your abode, bow your head for a few moments, dedicating your plans and affairs to me and pray for your family. Speak words of faith and peace. Rejoice, for I am your shepherd, and you shall lack nothing. You are my cherished sons and daughters, my delightful little flock. I will guide you to verdant pastures and tranquil waters. In your dwelling, there will be no more tumult or chaos, and the conflicts weighing on your heart shall dissipate. I shall expel malevolent forces, those who pilfer love and shatter peace within your abode. Every trace of sin and transgression lurking in the shadows, seeking to tarnish your faith and joy, shall be uprooted. Your sorrows will be lifted, and you will witness no affliction or destitution at your table. Bread will grace your table in its appointed time. The windows of heaven shall open wide, showering blessings upon you, more employment, educational opportunities, and avenues for new growth. I shall eradicate detrimental habits and vices from your dwelling that threaten your integrity and faith. You possess a purpose, a mission, and a commitment to me. No one else bears the responsibility. Do not await others to come to your aid when challenges arise. In times of difficulty, refrain from complaining that no one reaches out to uplift you. I am with you, and that is more than enough. There are those who criticize and reject you, seeking ways to pull you down. Yet, there is no need to seek love and acceptance from those who have allied with your adversaries. My love is all-encompassing, and my grace shall propel you forward. I shall shower blessings upon your dwelling, bringing prosperity and favor. You carry a calling and a mission. My promise stands unyielding. I shall envelop you in prosperity, peace, health, and provision. Uphold your part of our covenant, act with integrity in your dealings with me, and witness the windows of heaven opening with abundance and provision for your life and home. My love for you deepens each day, and I ask that you reciprocate. Declare that today marks the end of your storm and the conclusion of your tribulation. My divine breath sweeps across your sky, dispelling the clouds that shrouded you. My light ushers in a new day for you. Henceforth, you shall tread only on solid ground, leading to my blessings, allowing you to experience profound peace and happiness. My ears attentively listen to you, and I maintain silence out of love, preferring to hear your voice. Your prayer is to me like a melodious song of worship. Your tears shall transform into joy, and moments of pain shall give way to happiness. Your mind shall remain unclouded, for I shall always be present amid your thoughts, filling you with beautiful and eternal joy. Enveloped in the tender embrace of my Holy Spirit, you are shielded from harm. Though the world may unfold its share of challenges, your spirit rests in tranquility. Your unwavering trust in my word defines your identity, and with steadfast conviction, you believe in overcoming all obstacles. Today marks the culmination of years marked by pain. I will dispel grudges, sorrow, guilt, and regrets, transforming them into distant echoes. Recognize your immeasurable worth in my eyes. If only you could fathom it entirely, your joy would overflow. I will imprint this truth upon your heart, rendering you impervious to discouragement or the theft of your faith. Simply, count your blessings daily, for the air you breathe, life itself, family, friends, and the provision on your table. Open your eyes wider, unveiling additional blessings around you. Be patient and you will discern seemingly modest yet profound gifts. Lift your hands to the sky once more, expressing gratitude for the time and place you inhabit, as each day unfolds new reasons to live and thrive. Empowered with the ability to choose happiness over sadness, let no one sow doubt or pilfer your joy. Your eternal God is the source of your help, and divine assistance will cascade over you like a revitalizing waterfall. It will rejuvenate your body, kindle your mind with enthusiasm, and fill your soul with divine peace. Laughter will resonate from your mouth, new visions will be granted and dreams will manifest into reality. Immerse yourself in my word, come and listen daily, open your Bible, and be immersed. My Holy Spirit will guide you and reveal the truth. Pay no heed to those who aim to manipulate your life with false prophecies or threats. 
in moments of doubt, pray, and my Holy Spirit will comfort you. He will open your eyes, whispering that your Heavenly Father is your protector and no one can harm you. Speak it aloud and believe, my Heavenly Father is with me, no enemy has power over me. I seek your simple faith, humility in your heart, a reliance not on your own prudence, but a commitment to entrust your plans to me at the start of each day. Allow me to be your shepherd, guiding you to the lush green pastures you yearn for, where my presence reigns supreme, eclipsing your emotions. In this haven, anxiety finds no refuge, and your heart dwells in tranquility. Neither challenging days nor distressing news can disturb you. Anticipate the day when you come to know me more intimately, when you receive my forgiving love and embrace yourself as you are. I love you unconditionally, and this tender affection will transform you. Your character shall be refined, and you shall awaken each day without fear of what may transpire. You are not feeble, you are strong. You are not timid, you are courageous. You are not enslaved to despondency, for I have endowed you with a spirit of love and power. Those unstable emotions that ebb and flow shall yield to my authority. In place of anxiety and fear, my strength shall fill your heart. Today marks the receipt of your freedom and the realization of your true self. I envelop you with grace and you radiate with my truth, peace and blessings wherever you go. Your soul and heart find solace and I whisper words of affection to you, fortifying and calming you. You need not endure the storms in your mind day after day. There is no reason to suffer when others dictate it. When I declare that there is peace in your spirit, believe these potent words that hold the power to heal you. As you journey through this day, let praise be your constant companion, uplifting your spirit and anchoring your heart in the certainty of my presence. Through your worship, step into a realm where time and trials lose their grip where you and I engage in a sacred dance of love and reverence. Picture a space where the weight of depression, the shadows of fear, and the chains of self-pity dissolve into nothingness. Such is the power of heartfelt worship, a force so potent that even the darkest forces cannot withstand its light. Remember, I dwell in the midst of your praises. In these moments of adoration, draw closer to the essence of my being catching glimpses of the majesty of my power and the splendor of my glory. It's a space where your soul discovers true freedom and your spirit soars. Above all, worship me because I am worthy. The scriptures, a mosaic of divine wisdom, resound with the call to honor me, to bestow upon me the glory and praise rightfully mine. This is not merely an act of devotion, but a profound truth echoing through the heavens and the earth. No matter how dense the darkness shrouding your day may appear, the brilliant light of my presence is poised to pierce through. Worship serves as the conduit for this radiant light, glorifying me and equipping you to ascend beyond your circumstances, not merely enduring, but triumphing. With the assistance of my spirit, you can discover the art of living with an unwavering focus on me, while your problems remain on the periphery. This is the secret to a victorious existence, not a life devoid of challenges, but one marked by the overwhelming presence of my love and power. Today I bestow upon you joy and rekindle your zest for life, igniting your aspirations to help and serve. Embrace the opportunity I present for a fulfilling life, receiving my benevolent words, growing in wisdom and cultivating love. No longer must you endure suffering, blame yourself, or bear the weight of past mistakes on your shoulders. Open your heart to my forgiveness. Rest assured that my presence will perpetually accompany you day and night. In your prayers, you need not articulate a thousand words. I comprehend the language of your heart. When you say, help me, I shall be there. When you cry out, I can't go on, I will swiftly come to you, cradling you in my arms whispering sweetly of my deep love for you. You have unrestricted access to my throne. Come and converse with me about your needs. It brings me joy to hear you. I desire you to feel secure in the midst of any situation. Resist the grip of fear, for you are not alone. 
I am available to assist you in every circumstance. No matter what unfolds, I will always be attentive to your words. Champion your life. Honor the purpose I've planted within you. Allocate time for your family and focus on the people you hold dear. Shower them with the attention they deserve. Remain faithful in your work. Sidestep unnecessary conflicts and shun unhealthy thoughts. Stride in delight. Lift your arms in exaltation to the azure sky and express gratitude for the gift of your existence. I am the sole divine and supernatural antidote for all your tribulations. The destiny of your family and the road ahead rest in my capable hands. Keep in mind, I will never forsake you. Certain challenges in your journey can only be surmounted by you, for I am alongside you. Refuse to entertain the voices of doubt or discouragement in your thoughts. I will empower you and dispel all perplexity from your mind. I'll assist you patiently so you don't lose sight of what truly holds significance for you. The opinions or judgments of others bear no weight. As your family and you are under my protection, I know the path I am guiding you on. Even in moments of trial, I will always have the foremost place in your heart, and you will love, honor, extol, and obey me with the entirety of your intellect, spirit, and heart. Feel the depths of my love for you. There's no need to traverse with dragging feet, disheartened or lamenting your circumstances. I adore you, and today I shall manifest my love for you in myriad ways. I will demonstrate it with my powerful word, expressing it unequivocally. If conflicts arise, you will instantly feel the surge of this divine love enveloping you. Should sadness attempt to grip you, my embrace will be a sanctuary, dissolving all anguish and leaving your heart brimming with joy. Your family and friends will stand amazed, questioning the cause of your newfound joy. Even your adversaries will flee in terror, rendered powerless because you did not succumb to fear or allow them to make you suffer. Envision a supernatural wall of divine protection enveloping you. Outside your abode, thousands of angels will stand guard, ensuring the safety of your family day and night. Embrace this truth with unwavering faith. This love I harbor for you is authentic, as tangible as the air you breathe. It surpasses any miracle you could conceive, radiating power and beauty. My love envelops you, breathing life into you. It is the supreme blessing you can receive, prompting my admiration for your grateful attitude each day. When you awaken, expressing gratitude for your life and entrusting your destiny into my hands, you embody an exemplar of faith. Others may scoff at your belief in an omnipotent God whom you cannot see, but you understand the reality of my presence, my watchful eye over you, and my attentive care for your needs. Your life is being showered with blessings, and I encourage you to embrace them wholeheartedly. Share these blessings with your loved ones and treat every person with love without underestimating anyone. Judge not by appearances, but value everyone with kindness. Remember this as you encounter various people on your journey. Greet them with respect and smile with kindness. Do not dismiss my guidance, for one day you may encounter them again in a time and place beyond your current imagination. The exceptional kindness you show and the smiles you share today will become the keys that open doors for you in the future. People with resources, those in authority, and even those experiencing hardships but displaying humility. Do not reject, underestimate, or scorn them. If you can offer assistance, do so willingly. On your journey, you may come across individuals who embody angels, and if you heed my words and remain attentive, you will be greatly blessed. Profound joy will fill your heart. I want you to walk in victory, to lead others in my teachings, and to accept the triumph that is rightfully yours. You are a victor, a winner, and you have an omnipotent Heavenly Father who hears and answers your prayers. A legion of celestial warriors stands as your safeguard, ensuring your protection at every moment. What else do you require to recognize your inherent value and embrace the security within? Knowing you are a true champion, I chose you before your very existence, positioning you in a pivotal time and place. I eagerly await your ascent, urging you to commit to your purpose and mission. Today you will conquer challenges, conflicts, illnesses, and adversaries. 
Sadness and discouragement shall not hold you captive. Defeat is not your destiny. Joy and strength will permeate your being, and I shall grant you peace, serenity, and tranquility. I am here, do not be distressed. I comprehend the trials you face, and to calm your heart, know that everything will indeed be fine. Fret not. Immerse your mind in this holy, pure, powerful, and life-affirming word, casting aside the fears that plagued you yesterday and robbed you of your peace. Fixate on this moment. Engrave it in bold letters on paper, placing it beside your Bible to open every morning. Before delving into its verses, express gratitude and proclaim aloud, I will not fear, I will not faint. My God is with me. Nothing can overcome me. So it shall be. Fear shall no longer take root as you reclaim your strength and anchor your hopes in the promise of a brighter future. Why harbor fear of adversaries who hold no power over you? Invest your time and energies, as well as those of your family, in meaningful pursuits. Cherish the people around you, recognizing their worth far surpasses material possessions, titles, trophies, or achievements. Enemies and those harboring ill intentions aren't worthy of your attention or anger. Pause for a moment and grant me the chance to refine your character. Refrain from immediate responses when faced with offense or attempts to disrupt your peace. When you do respond, let it be infused with kindness. A response steeped in love can penetrate even the most calloused heart. Permit my Holy Spirit to articulate through your words. In a world of confusion, where many live in perpetual unrest and project their frustrations onto you, your well-tended field and calm demeanor stand out. They may provoke you in an attempt to incite a loss of control, but they will not succeed. I am your God, the sovereign of your heart, guiding you in the way to respond. Witness how people are astonished by the transformation in your character. No longer will they perceive you as sad, agitated, depressed, or angry. Regardless of whether your family acknowledges your efforts, focus on the goal. Your faith and the power of your decisions are stronger than steel. Exert yourself and be courageous. Many have forsaken their purpose and lament their circumstances, but a distinct future awaits you. My presence envelops you. My spirit reigns in your home. The windows of heaven shall open over you, bestowing blessings and gifts that will fill your home with joy. Hearts turned remorseful shall return, even those who once departed. A season of forgiveness and unity is upon us. Do not be apprehensive, for I am by your side. Do not be disheartened as I am your God. I will strengthen you, support you, and lift you with my triumphant right hand. I have showered abundant blessings upon you in celestial realms, so that my glory may radiate within your family, extending this grace to your friends, relatives, and neighbors leaving an indelible mark on their lives and homes. You shall be the conduit through which healing flows to many familiar faces. This extraordinary work begins here, prompting you to join every morning in listening. Recall the miracles I have already wrought in your life and how this word has materialized in seemingly insurmountable situations that once caused you to stumble. Up to this juncture, I have been your ally. Do not backtrack. Do not relinquish what you have attained. Henceforth, significant blessings are on the horizon, yet I long to see you each morning with a grateful heart, embracing this word with warmth. There is no need to fear, for crises hold no dominion. The world's threats may attempt to deceive you, painting a picture of a path without an exit. Yet, I have come to breathe a life into you, fortifying your faith and illuminating your spiritual vision. Heaven rejoices at your decision to invite me into your life, to follow my word and obey me. I will restore all that has been taken from you. Walk boldly, for your destiny rests securely in my hands. Every adversary is defeated. Come now, pray to me with unwavering faith and all the beautiful desires in your heart. I shall lovingly grant you. I understand your heart well. There is nothing you can hide from me. Confide in me with confidence at any time. 
share your situation and emotions. I am attentive to your feelings and needs, just as I have always been. My care for you remains steadfast, evident in the rescue and gift of a new life. You cannot expect love or understanding from the world. But with me, you have everything to satisfy your need for peace, to have your life enveloped in my love, and your heart filled with the powerful emotion that comes from being deeply loved. My love for you is unwavering, even when doubts arise. In times of adversity, my love never falters. I loved you, love you, and will continue to love you. Cease investing your affection in those who betray and undervalue it. Do not prioritize those who make you weep. They do not deserve the foremost place in your heart. That place is rightfully mine. Recognize and respect me. Hold the reverence you owe me in your life. I should be your God, Lord and King, no one else. If someone else has taken my place, it might be one reason why you've felt unwell in recent days. There's an unexplained void within you that will grow if you reject my love. Your sadness, tears in the night, and the desire to feel loved stem from searching for love in the wrong places. No one in this world can love you as I can. Seek me for peace, love, and rest. Why wait? Why continue to give your life and affection to those who cause you so much suffering? Return to me before more tears fall. We shall walk hand in hand, and I shall clasp your hand with unwavering strength. Concentrate on the goodness, purity, and marvelous things I yearn to bring into your life. Shun negative companionships and refrain from returning to those who linger in despair. I am your provider, capable of bestowing happiness upon you. Thus, there is no need to seek acceptance or approval from others. Just as I require no permission from anyone to shower you with blessings, you need not seek anyone else's approval to love and serve me. The answer is clear. You can find pure and unyielding love only in me. It consoles and heals you. I am the sole being in this vast universe who sacrificed and rose again for you. Providing salvation and eternal happiness, beseech me now, beloved, for this enduring love to be bestowed upon you. The miracle you await shall unfold, and the matter troubling you shall find resolution. Your prayer has resonated in my celestial throne, and your response will soon arrive. Yet when it does, refrain from following the path of those who receive their desires and forget the giver. I implore you to use these endured situations to infuse wisdom into your heart. As you witness the resolution of all, prepare yourself for a life of gratitude and prayer. Each day, it costs you nothing to open your eyes and simply utter, Thank you, God. It is not a burdensome task. I seek not your material possessions. I desire no offerings unless they emanate from your sincere and thankful spirit. This is how blessings genuinely multiply in your life. When you receive an answer to your prayer, however, if you forget the God who rescued you and believe you have achieved everything through your own strength, be warned, your blessings will gradually fade like a flower without water. Rather than dwelling on your perceived inadequacies, embrace and accept them. Your sense of lack is the very link that binds you to my inexhaustible sufficiency. When faced with the appearance of insufficient resources, the natural inclination might be to succumb to worry. However, the most fitting response to this temptation is to openly acknowledge your limitations and express gratitude for them. This act of thanksgiving liberates you from the false belief that you must be your own savior and provider. Your human frailties and imperfections necessitate a savior who is infinitely strong and flawlessly perfect, a provider capable of meeting all your needs. Access to my limitless resources comes through a delicate balance of stillness and action. Time spent in solitude with me, patiently waiting in my presence, deepens your connection to me. I actively work on behalf of those who eagerly await me, accomplishing for you what surpasses your own capabilities. While some tasks are within your ability, engaging in your daily activities with reliance on the strength I provide brings glory to me and invites blessings in return. The next time you find yourself feeling inadequate, turn toward me without hesitation. 
I lovingly meet you at your point of need. Remember the comforting words of Philippians 4.19. And my God will meet all your needs according to the riches of His glory in Christ Jesus. Additionally, Isaiah 64.4 reminds us, Since ancient times, no one has heard, no ear has perceived, no eye has seen any God besides you who acts on behalf of those who wait for Him. Therefore, in moments of perceived inadequacy, let your heart not be troubled. Trust in my provision and care. Lean into your limitations, for they are the gateways to experiencing my power and grace in the midst of your weakness. In your insufficiency, my strength becomes manifest. Your gaps are filled by my sufficiency. Embrace your neediness as an opportunity to deepen your reliance on me and witness how I transform your worries into a living testament of my unwavering faithfulness. So step forward with confidence, not in your own abilities, but in my never-ending provision and strength. Every moment of need is an invitation to encounter my boundless love and power in your life. In your inadequacy, discover the fullness of my grace and the unwavering assurance of my constant presence. Amen.